narrated by Bukhari in volume 4, book 61, the book of virtues, chapter 25, the signs of prophethood in Islam, hadith number 3624. Aisha narrates, the prophet was on his deathbed when he whispered something into the ear of Lady Fatum. I asked her what he had said and she replied, the Prophet said, I am the chief of the women of paradise. In volume 5, book 62, The Virtues of the Companions of the Prophet, chapter 12, The Virtues of the Relatives of the Prophet and the Merits of Fatima, the Chief of the Women of Paradise, Hadith number 3713, Abu Bakr narrates, Look at Muhammad through his family. If you are not good to his family, you are not good to him. In the same chapter, on the merits of Fatima, the following hadith number 3714, Al-Miswar bin Makhrama narrates, Allah's Messenger said, Fatima is a part of me, and he who makes her angry, makes me angry. After the death of the Prophet, Muslim narrates in volume 3, book 32, the book of Jihad and Expeditions, Chapter 16, Hadith number 1759 Aisha narrates that Lady Fatima sent someone to Abu Bakr regarding her inheritance which he had confiscated. He replied that he had heard the Prophet say, whatever we leave is to be given in charity. Aisha continues the narration and says that Fatima became angry with Abu Bakr. In her sermon at the Prophet's mosque, she replies, where is it in the book of Allah that you inherit your father, but I do not inherit mine? She then quoted Surah Naml, the ant, verse 16, where Allah says, Sulaiman inherited his father Dawood. And then Surah Maryam, where Prophet Zakariya in verses 5 and 6 prays to Allah for a son to inherit him. In the same hadith, Aisha says that Fatima refused to speak to Abu Bakr until she passed away. Bukhari also narrates in volume 8, book 85, the book of Al-Fara'id, the laws of inheritance, chapter 3, hadith number 6726. The Aisha narrates, Fatima left Abu Bakr and did not speak to him till she passed away. This is narrated again by Bukhari in volume 5, book 64, the book of Al-Maghazi, chapter 39, hadith numbers 4240 and 4241, where Aisha again narrates, Abu Bakr refused to give anything of the inheritance to Fatima, so she became angry with him and did not talk to him until she passed away. The narration continues saying that she was buried at night in secret without informing Abu Bakr. Bukhari narrates in volume 8, book 81, the book of al riqaq chapter 53, discussing the pool of Kothar on the Day of Judgment, Hadith number 6576, where Abdullah bin Zayd narrates from the Prophet himself. He says, Some of you will be brought in front of me, I will see who they are, and then they will be taken away from me, and I will say, O Lord, my companions. It will be said, You do not know what they innovated in the religion after you left.